Hello everyone, how are you all doing? In this video, we are going to talk about the iOS 18.1 Beta 5. Yes, Apple has released the iOS 18.1 Beta 4 and it's been few days that I have been using it on my device. In this video, I'm going to talk about how has iOS 18.1 Beta 4 performing on my iPhones and basically this is a follow-up of iOS 18.1 Beta 4 on my device and we are going to talk about the iOS 18.1 Beta 5 release date, when Apple is going to release it. Also, what all features and new things we are expecting to arrive on iOS 18.1 Beta 5. My name is Jay, you are watching Tech Hyped. If you are new here, consider hitting that subscribe button because I keep on making these type of videos for you guys and I don't want you guys to miss these. Let's get right into today's video. Okay, so I have been using this update on my device for the past couple of days. So jump straight to the point performance how has been the performance on my device on this ios 18.1 beta 4 the performance seems to be uh, about the same as the previous version but uh, to be honest uh, performance is something that i don't have a lot of complaints about since i installed the ios 18 but uh, yeah it is about the same or uh, if not on par with the previous version so don't expect anything good in terms of performance it won't be any better or worse compared to earlier now coming to the part which we all really want to know the battery life yes i know ios 18 has one of the worst battery life in past couple of times that we have experienced ios 18 like 18 in general 18.0 18.1 betas ios 18 has been horrible in terms of battery life and so is this update i i'm just not expecting anything good from any update right now on ios 18 it is having one of the most terrible battery life i have had in the past one year i mean i'm just having really bad experience in terms of battery life i'm i'm not sure about you guys but uh, my friends who are using the ios 18 and 18.1 version are also having the same issue the battery drain is just horrible on ios 18 in general let me know down in comments below what is your experience and are you guys also having battery drain on your device or not because personally i'm having really bad battery life on pretty much all of my devices not to forget the performance is also slowed down a little bit but uh, it is still not that big of a change that we have seen in terms of battery life screen on time going down battery is horrible on ios 18.1 beta 4 as well i am having my phone last uh about five and a half hours off screen on time if i use it outdoors uh, on cellular data all the time and uh, about seven hours uh, actually less than seven hours uh, but yeah seven hours at max if i am using it indoors and uh, on wi-fi whole day okay 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 keeping the battery thing apart features and changes new features and changes ios 18.1 beta 4 did not brought anything big in terms of changes we had some small little changes like the control center and all but yeah i don't really think so that those changes are enough to be called as big features so we'll just not talk about that because i'm pretty sure you guys are already aware about that and in this video we should talk about the general experience and uh, the performance battery life which we have already talked about now the bugs the bugs yeah ios 18.1 has been having really bad bugs as well but there is a good news the ios 18.1 beta 4 has fixed a lot of bugs for me i was having the wi-fi disconnection issue bug which is now finally fixed the keyboard was making weird sound sometimes that is also now finally fixed last but not the least the control center was having some freaky weird animations while opening and closing so that is also fixed now on the beta 4 now let's talk about the ios 18.1 beta 5 release date and what new changes are expected on that version so ios 18.1 beta 5 is expected to arrive probably next week because it feels like apple is on a one week cycle right now and not to forget we want ios 18.1 to get perfect and released to everyone as soon as possible because iphone 16 is now finally out and uh, we want people to experience the new features and new ai features and all 
on their devices as soon as possible. So fingers crossed, hope so. The new features of iOS 18.1, the AI features and all should be available to people on iPhone 15 Pro and iPhone 16 Pro and 16 series both really, really soon. So let's see, let's wait and see when Apple releases the iOS 18.1 to public. But right now we will have one or two more betas until the final release. And I'm pretty sure that we are going to get the iOS 18.1 beta 5 as soon as next week. The day I'm recording this video, it is 21st of September and we are going to get the iOS 18.1 beta 5 between 23rd to 25th. Anything between 23rd to 25th is the expected date when we are going to get the iOS 18.1 beta 5 on our devices. Well, that's pretty much it for today's video. Thank you so much for watching this video till the end. This is me, J aka Tech Hybrid, and I am signing off. Peace out and have a great day, everyone.